We're in Kiwani this morning. Well, not us, but no. Emily's there. Emily is there. Mm -hmm. She's exploring the Bazadney Fish Facility. Good morning, Em. Good morning, everyone. I'm here with Scott Stromberger. We're out here at the Sodney Fish Facility in Kiwani, and they're getting ready for the salmon run. Scott, for people that aren't aware of it, what is the salmon run? Well, uh, salmon are originally from the Pacific Northwest. We brought them here to control invasive species. Um, but salmon naturally run upriver to um, spawn in their own breeding grounds. Uh, here in Wisconsin, it would be the Kiwani River. Also, other, la other tributaries of Lake Michigan, they come up to spawn as well. So, at this facility, we, um, will, we have uh, pumps to where they can jump up fish ladders and bring them into the facility. We can collect their eggs and, and uh, keep the uh, production of uh, sport fishery happening here in Wisconsin. And this is like a viewing, underwater viewing area for people. I know you were talking about the river. It's a little cloudy right now. Yes, I mean, with all the heavy rains and the runoff, uh, you know, the Kiwani River watershed is over 90,000 square acres, so it's a lot of land and to, you know, run off a lot of uh, nutrients, mainly clay particles. So that's why the water is so cloudy right now. And when you have your open house Saturday, <laughs> October 4th, people are going to see it a little different out here, right? There's The pumps are going to be running, but they're not running right now, and that's because? Correct. Well, there really isn't enough salmon here uh, in our raceway to be able to collect eggs at the amount that we would like to collect them. So we're keeping the pumps off here for a couple weeks. We're going to kick them on at that time, and by that time there'll be plenty more salmon to be able to do that process. They just have to wait. Exactly. <laughs> They're just going to hang out and enjoy the current. So what's all going to be able to, what are people going to be able to do at the open house on the 4th? So we have a lot of different activities. One is um, we're going to be collecting eggs from our Chinook salmon here on that day, Saturday, October 4th. Um, we will uh, also have all kinds of activities for kids. They can do fish printing on t-shirts, build their own spinner lures, uh, fly tying demonstrations. Uh, you know, there's going to be food and beverages provided, and it'll just be a really fun day it, uh, it here at the hatchery. It should be a really fun time. And, you know, some of these salmon, one we just saw a little bit ago, they have markings and stuff on them, but why is that? They're not hurt, right? No, I mean, it probably does, you know, hurt them a smart a little bit, but, um, you know, towards the end of their life when they are spawning, uh, they, they will kind of injure themselves um, by kind of battling for um, the, you know, good spawning grounds. So Definitely. they're used to it. Well, come out here Saturday, October 4th. You can learn more by going to our website, fox11online.com. We'll send it back to you. Wow. Thanks, Sam.